Hi, this is Dr. Michael Ryan with Missouri Vein Care answering the question, what is venous stasis or venous eczema? And what does it mean when my legs are itching? Well, it's, it's actually a common uh, side effect of, of stagnant circulation in the veins, which is the underlying problem with vein disease. The circulation inside the veins is not functioning properly because the valves have failed and the blood backs up into the legs under pressure and it's not flowing properly. The stagnant blood triggers an inflammation reaction in the tissues. That inflammation is what you see in venous eczema. And eczema is an inflammation condition. Or venous dermatitis. Dermatitis is <clears throat> dermatitis is the medical term meaning inflammation of the skin. So what you see with those conditions is uh, all the typical signs of inflammation, and they're they're fairly classic uh, in in medical terms. Uh, there is redness. There's um, itching. There is swelling. Uh, there is a, uh, a, a tenderness associated with it, and uh, often with venous eczema and venous uh, stasis dermatitis, you have thickening of the and scar tissue developing in the skin. So people with this condition will get a discolored patch. And if you feel that skin, and it's typically on the inner lower calf around the ankle, the skin is very tough and thick. And that represents scar tissue, which is a response the body has whenever there's inflammation present for a long period of time. Uh, what's interesting about venous eczema, uh, and there's a medical description called uh, uh, annular uh, eczema, because annular means circular, is there's uh, often patches of eczema on the lower leg, usually below the knee, and they're often associated with an underlying vein condition, and those will often resolve with treatment. Uh, not many physicians are aware of that relationship and also the possibility that vein treatments can help. But typically when I see a patient with annular eczema on their leg, I will take a look with the ultrasound. And uh, what I typically see under the, uh, the eczema patch is a, a plexus, which is a collection of abnormal veins. And you can tell with an ultrasound if you're uh, used to seeing veins in the, in the leg, what's normal and what's not normal. These are very abnormal. They're, they're enlarged, they're distended, and there's usually a whole uh, plexus of them, as we call. Sometimes there's even what we call a subdermal venous lake. That's the medical term, meaning it's under the skin and a venous lake. Imagine it's just a big pool of blood. It's And the, the fundamental problem with this venous lake or these, these collections of veins is the blood is stagnant. And whenever you have stagnant blood, it triggers inflammation. That area of, of, of eczema does respond to treatment. And we what we do is we close the abnormal veins down that are bringing pressure into the veins uh, with a different a variety of techniques, including injection treatments. And as they uh, clear up, uh, people are just uh, ecstatic and surprised. So Dr. Mike Ryan answering the question, what is venous dermatitis and venous eczema?